At the 2025 World Robot Conference in Beijing, China, Dr. Zhang Jifeng, founder of Kaiwa Technology, was present. He was affiliated with Nanyang Technology University and researched on a matter during 2025. During his research, he found something interesting. A robot was implanted with the fetus and subsequently entered a stage of pregnancy. It was a human fetus, not a robot. A robot can become pregnant and deliver a healthy baby. Shocking. The plan is finalized and it was announced that the prototype is scheduled to be launched in 2026. Interesting. How does this gestation robot work and what is the process? I'll share the key points. Currently, it is in testing phase. The robot is designed in a human-like form and is exactly the same as a woman's body. Fetus was implanted in a robot and it grew. The fetus is nourished through tubes and shielded in synthetic amniotic fluid just like it happens in a woman's body. It received nourishment through tubes and breathed in the same way as a real baby. They were successful and the robot is ready to deliver a human baby who is nourished with tubes. How does it work? Let me explain. Much like women, who feel deep connection through the smell, warmth and communication with their babies. Similarly, this humanoid robot also experiences such feelings with her child and communicates with warmth. How did they get this idea? In 2017, researchers implanted a lamb fetus into the robot, which later became pregnant and delivered a healthy lamb. They then attempted the similar experience using a human fetus and implanted in a humanoid robot. Now we'll see whether it succeeds in 2026. Who's behind the project and this research? Dr. Zhang Chifeng is the main scientist who is an expert. He has a PhD from Nanyang Tel Technological University and founder of Kaiwa Technology, launched in 2015. They have sold many robots since then. Robots such as those working as waiters or those that physically move files between locations. From the past two years, Nanyang Technological University and Kaiwa Technology have been affiliated. They are aiming to create a full-term humanoid robotic mother. Let's see if it succeeds. It is truly amazing. The company has previously worked on service robots and has started engaging authorities for policy and legal discussions about this technology. I will share the cost and other details regarding the humanoid robotic mother. First, the main aim is to help infertile couples become happy parents with the support of a humanoid robot. Secondly, individuals who wish to remain single or not marry but still experience parenthood can have a child through a robot. Those who do not wish to undergo biological pregnancy but still desire to be parents. In cases where childbirth complications may risk the life of the mother or baby, couples can still experience parenthood through a child delivered by a robot. A 
Another motive is to address China's falling birth rate. Such robots will help deliver babies. You may know that many couples undergo IVF treatments, which are often risky and very expensive. However, delivering a baby through a robot might be easier. This process will cost about 100,000 yuan, that is approximately 12 lakhs 18,500 rupees in Indian currency. Surrogacy involves implanting a fertilized embryo into another woman who carries and delivers the baby for the couple, which is a costly process. However, this prototype is cheaper. But many people do not agree to this and have diverse views. I'll share them. A person commented saying, whose sperm and eggs would be used? The process is barely understandable. How is that possible? Will a different embryo be implanted? This is disruption to conventional family rules and human identity. I do not agree to it. Another person commented saying this will undermine the value of motherhood, so shall not be implemented. Diverse views exist. The comment acknowledged this decision, noting that many women suffer during pregnancy but still wish to conceive. A humanoid robot will ease the pregnancy process. IVF is very risky and expensive. This humanoid robotic mother is comparatively cheaper and highly effective. Different views exist. Let's wait and see whether China announces the success of this prototype in 2026.